Good morning, everybody. So, I am not getting paid to do this at all. I'm just putting my honest review out there. And this, and it's going to be about the Shea Moisture Apple Cider Vinegar Anti-Dandruff uh, four-piece hair treatment. And <clears throat> excuse me, so I've so uh, and man, I'm giving it a five out of five, 50 out of 50, whatever, however many stars you want to give this thing, I give it like full stars. So I go to my my hairdresser. Uh, I'm supposed to do it like twice a month, but you know, going to school and working is kind of hard. And then trying to make an appointment with her because she is highly, highly coveted. Her name is Candace and she works for Lugo Salon here in Riverview. And um, she said that she recommends me finding a uh, an acidic uh, hair regimen that I can do myself at home, you know, to revitalize my scalp because I suffer from dry scalp dandruff buildup. And um, so, you know, trying a lot of products that say that they have that they help didn't help. I even tried doing just a basic apple cider vinegar washout, and it just I still had dandruff in my hair, but my scalp was good, but I still had dandruff in my hair. Um, and every time I brushed it out, I just kept brushing flakes off of the scalp. So, regular apple cider vinegar rinse out, you know, really didn't help much and I tried it for three months straight washing my hair once a week for three months straight and rinsing it out with apple cider vinegar no so I decided to uh, do Shea Moisture and I used a lot of Shea Moisture products that's supposed to you know revamp my dry hair and then I really then I started going to Candace and she said my hair is not the problem my scalp is so I said okay let's see if we can if I can find something that can revitalize my scalp so I went on to the Shea Moisture website and they have a hair quiz where you know based off of your answers it gives you the best recommended suggestive hair care product system that they have. And I've read a lot about Shea Moisture and I even, you know, looked at a lot of Shea Moisture reviews. I asked my family, I asked my friends, and they, you know, they have good reviews. I even asked strangers at the store and they raved about Shea Moisture. So I decided a couple weeks ago, to go on to the Shea Moisture website and I did the hair quiz and it came up with the Shea Moisture Apple Cider Vinegar Anti-Dandruff uh, for part treatment with the pre-wash, the shampoo and conditioner and the leave-in conditioner. So I wanted to see the reviews on this. So I went to YouTube and I saw it in action. This young lady, she did her hair with it and she, you know, she did the little microscope thing or whatever. I guess she had somebody, obviously she had somebody help her. She had a lot of dandruff and buildup on her scalp. And she, you know, did the comey thing to get it off her scalp and stuff. So, but she still had a lot of buildup. She did one side with the with the pit thing comb to scratch it off, and the other side she left alone. So she did a control. So one side she did the you know pre wash, which I have on my scalp right now. It says leave in for ten minutes, and I have a cooling sensation. And this is the second again. This is the second time I've used it, and I have a cooling sensation, which I know works because she said if you don't feel that cooling sensation. Um, it means that, you know, you've been doing a good job. You've been doing great. You don't have a lot of dandruff. You don't have a lot of buildup on your scalp. And your scalp is becoming healthier. So uh, the other half, she just used, you know, 
her regular shampoo that she, you know, blurred out the name of in the video. So the half that was washed with the regular anti-dandruff shampoo, um, she still had dandruff and buildup on her scalp and in her hair. On the other side that she used the anti-dandruff Shea Moisture four-piece uh, hair care pro system, she did the pre-wash and then she did the shampoo then she did the conditioner, she did the leave-in conditioner, she styled her hair um, by flattening it, and but you could see her scalp was healthy and it was clear, it was like bright white, I guess, like healthy. And the other side was still red and, you know, you could still like see the flakes coming off of each of the comb, but she had two combs, one for the controlled side, one for the other side. So for the controlled side, still dandruff. For the uh, anti-dandruff Shea Moisture, she used the comb and she, you know, scratched it. Nothing came up. So for me, I told my husband to buy it for me. He did. And the first time I used it, I was in shock. No dandruff in my hair. No dandruff on my scalp. And it's been two weeks since I washed my hair. Because, you know, midterms and everything. And so, yeah. So, uh, here it is, spring break. I'm washing my hair for a second time. And you can see, sort of like, you can see the dandruff right there. It's coming off and it does not hurt. Usually, you know, when I scratch my head, my head hurts. But this time, my head does not hurt. So, I highly recommend Shea Moisture Anti-Dandruff shampoo conditioner pre-wash and leave-in conditioner because it it helped me and i i have tried like over 50 different hair care products and this has really worked so if you're looking for an honest review i honestly honestly recommend the anti-dandruff line from shea moisture honest it's oh my goodness but please please follow the instructions because right now the tingling sensation is starting to get to me and it's been 10 minutes is it 